All right, what's up everyone? It's Nicholas Wildstar, Libertarian candidate for California governor with another Q&A with Wildstar video. It's been an another busy week for me <laughs> since I've been preparing to have my first fundraiser, which will be on December 16th. A very wonderful and loving family that supports my candidacy for governor has offered to host the event at their beautiful home. But to lock in the festivities, we need to have a minimum of 30 guests confirmed by December 10th. So please be sure to RSVP today. Each guest will be served appetizers, a three-course meal with desserts, and will have drinks available to them at an open bar. There's also going to be music, live performances, prize raffles, special gifts, and will be a kid-friendly environment. So feel free to bring along everyone. I'll also be autographing copies of my new album, Evolve or Die, which is the second installment of my Cue Ball Presents the Trilogy series that will be officially released online December 12th. I've been putting the finishing touches on it this week, which also is why my time has been tied up. So if you'd like to hear what I've been working on, be sure to grab your free copy of Evolve or Die on 1212. And yes, I said free. So there's no reason why all of you out there shouldn't be downloading a copy unless you, you know, net neutrality is removed and you're charged by your internet provider to access YouTube, SoundCloud, or any other website they may want to charge you to access. Um, I'm giving away my album and my music, not only because I want to avoid any music licensing issues for samples that I use, but I want to make sure that I'm heard by the world and especially you people out there living in California. The mainstream media doesn't really like to give much publicity to third party candidates since we're actually the ones challenging the political status quo. It's up to we the people to spread the message about these grassroots efforts to one another. Word of mouth is a very powerful tool and thanks to the internet, the things we say can reach far and wide and can become viral in a matter of minutes. As someone seeking public office, this will help me bypass those who would like for me to remain silent and give me the chance to speak up as a representative for those people that are constantly ignored. I'd like to use my musical talents to enrich our communities, strengthen our neighborhoods, and let people know that the politicians that have failed us can be easily replaced through a political revolution. I'm obviously not your typical run-of-the-mill candidate, which leads me to answer the question <laughs> that I've been asked, which is, what am I going to do to overcome identity politics? As difficult of a question as that may seem, my answer is simple. Be myself. I don't pander anyone for votes. I'm not aiming to be politically correct. I'm not compromising my moral beliefs or political ideals for the sake of bipartisanship. By me being me, I'm hoping that all of the people of California that want to have a state where they'll be able to keep every single dollar that they've worked for, want to have a safe neighborhood where their lives aren't being threatened by the people they've hired to protect them, and want to experience a free country like never before, will hear my message of liberty and elect me, me their center. Of course, there will be those that see me as being any and every stereotype that they can think of, and I'd be ignorant to say that I won't be dealing with those prejudices head on. I'll do my best to shatter each and every negative image that the media will attempt to label me as. However, the ultimate decision will be up to you to exercise your own judgment when it comes to voting for the person you think will best represent the desires you have for living in this state. Let me assure you that no other candidate that you will elect, whether they be a Democrat, a Republican, or even a Libertarian, will be more dedicated to bringing an end to taxation without representation, constitutional and civil rights violations, and an overpaid, overbearing, corrupt government than me, Nicholas Wildstar. So please be sure to support my run for California governor by donating to my campaign, offering to help as a volunteer, 
or by spreading the word and sharing this video. <laughs> it's up to us to make sure that the revolution will be televised. So join me by visiting my website, Wildstar 2018 today, and let's bring back liberty to the great state of California. Thank you to all of you out there for watching and um, thank you to the viewer that submitted today's question. If you'd like for me to answer any of yours in my next video, please be sure to send that to me by email, send it to my inbox, or of course, you can just leave it here in the comments and I will be sure to give you a response in one of my upcoming videos. Have a great evening, everyone, and have an even greater, greater weekend. And see you all again next time. Peace.